words of affirmation to strengthen your spirit and change your life. These words of affirmation have been carefully chosen from the Bible to strengthen your spirit. Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised. The praise of God shall forever be declared on my lips. I am the head and not the tail. I stay above only. I shall not know shame, anguish, or sorrow. Doors are opening to me on their own accord. Those gathered against me are scattered abroad. Association of wickedness against me and my household are dismantled. The Lord turns the counsel of my adversaries into foolishness. Every conspirator against me becomes a patriot to my upliftment, for the Lord will give me a mouth, an utterance, and a wisdom that all of my foes will be unable to refute in Jesus' fame. The Lord keeps me in perfect peace because my mind stays on and trusts Him. My soul desires Him in the nighttime. My spirit seeks Him early. My soul silently waits for God. From you alone comes my salvation. Lead me always to the rock that is higher than me. My soul will depend on you alone. My God, who is wise in counsel and excellent in guidance, I will be satisfied early by your loving kindness in Jesus' name. I am saved and delivered from all oppression of the enemy. I receive victory for every challenge that comes my way. The Lord's ears are inclined to every prayer I make to Him. I receive speedy answers to all my supplications. The Lord's eyes are opened to supervise the downfall of the wicked in my life. I am not a victim, but a victor in life's battlefield. I am not cast down, nor destroyed. I am raised and lifted at all times in Jesus' name. The word of the Lord stand forever. The word of the Lord is settled in my life. Good tidings are brought to me every day of my life. I receive good news from a far country. The mouth of the Lord has spoken peace to me. Your breath, O Lord, activates every inactive potential in me. The works of my hands are established. I receive fresh, solid ideas from heaven. I receive grace and strength to execute them to perfection. My fame goes far and wide because God's grace upon my life abounds forever in Jesus' name. I am an eternal excellence, a joy of many generations. Generations after me call me blessed because I leave an inheritance and a legacy for my children's children, which are past, even from one generation to the next. I drink from the breast of kings. Strangers shall serve me. I am a crown of glory in the hand of the Lord, and a royal diadem in the hand of my God. I am no longer termed forsaken, because my gates are surrounded by great merchandise. My walls shall be called salvation, and my gates named praise in Jesus' name. I declare that Spirit of the Lord is upon me. He teaches me witty inventions. My mind is receptive to great inventions released from God's throne. I conceive great ideas in science and technology. I am an inventor and a co-creator with God. My innovations are exported abroad and explored at home. My land will profit greatly because of my innovations. I will eat the good of my land. Unthinkable things come out of my land. My fame goes far and wide. I am a well-trained steward. I have learned discipline and loyalty in service. I am obedient to constituted authority. Not partially, but absolutely. Rebellion and recalcitrance are not found in me. When I err, I admit my wrong and repent of it immediately. I am able to retrace my steps back to God easily. My character is solidly built as I practice godly habits. I am sustained in high and mighty places because I possess a solid character. I am teachable and receptive. I do not possess a haughty spirit, but a subtle one. God has given me wisdom, and my speeches are always seasoned in due season. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me. The Spirit of wisdom, knowledge, understanding. The Spirit of counsel and might and the fear of the Lord. I'm empowered to do exploits. 
My spirit is aligned to the Spirit of the Lord. I am always alert in the Spirit. I am awake and not slumbering in spirit. My spiritual antennae are properly tuned. I possess an excellent spirit and it reflects in everything I do. My mind is renewed by the word daily. I do not conform to my current surroundings. I am daily transformed by the renewing of my mind. I daily acquire knowledge and skills that bring me before great men and places. I am not limited by my thinking. I have a deeper understanding than my counterparts through the inspiration of the Holy Spirit. I explore various concepts that result in powerful establishments. My mental exploits are solidly accepted by all, and they transcend my generation. I possess a superior argument on matters through the inspiration of the Spirit. I am a blessing to my generation. I am quick to fulfill the plan and purpose God has destined for me from the beginning. I am born to be a trailblazer in my generation. I am a supernatural being. People will see God's light in me and be marveled at His good deeds, glorifying His name. Through the light in me, souls would be drawn to the light of God. I am born to win. The Lord has disappointed the devices of the crafty against me. Their hands cannot perform their enterprise over me anymore. I receive the wisdom of God and the knowledge of things to come in all areas of my life. I ride on the wings of the Father. I am rest assured that my steps are ordered by the one whose hands stretched out the heavens. I work by the leading of the Holy Spirit and His direction for all my ways. In Jesus' name I am bought with a price. Therefore, my body and spirit shall glorify God. The blood of Jesus that saves, delivers, and sets free shall work for me and my family. For I know that, if I walk in the light, my sins are forgiven. Therefore, from now henceforth, I walk in the light. I arise and shine. The full expression of the light is revealed in and through me in Jesus' name. I do not walk in the company of wicked men. I do not join the company of mockers. I renounce the company of evil doers. I will not be led by them. My heart is filled with love and not in contention with my neighbor. I do not imitate the deeds of evil doers. I am not vengeful or filled with wrath. My mind is daily transformed unto righteousness. I cast down every imagination and thoughts that exalts itself against the knowledge of God and bring them to the obedience of Christ. I am God's favored child. Favor surrounds me everywhere I go and in everything I do. I am encompassed with favor as a shield. God establishes the work of my hands. I have favor with God and man today. All day long, people go out of their way to bless me and to help me. Doors that were once closed are now opened for me. By the favor of God, everything I do prospers. I walk in supernatural increase and promotion going forward. In Jesus' name, I overcome all things because greater is He that is in me than he that is in the world. I stand having my loins girded about with truth. I have the breastplate of righteousness. My feet are shod with the gospel of peace, and I take with me the shield of faith. In my daily walk with God, I am covered with the helmet of salvation, and I profitably use the sword of the Spirit. I operate from an advantageous position, and I am blessed for the rest of my days. In Jesus' name. Wealth and riches are in my house. My family is blessed beyond the economic situation of earthly realities. My children are taught of the Lord and great is the peace of my family. We are forever the head and never the tail. We are people of relevance and a force to be reckoned with. The work of our hands are recommended to kings and those who matter. All our prayers have become our present day reality. In Jesus' name, I am more honorable than my peers. I am blessed by the Lord, and no sorrow is added unto it. I am blessed indeed, and my coast is enlarged. The hand of the Lord is with me. 
I am kept from all evil, no evil shall grieve me, my children and my family. I declare the ears of the Lord are hearkened to my request, and my situation changes for the better. Sorrow has no root in my dwelling because the Lord is my habitation. Now and forever, I experience an overflow of joy. My source, life, and being, I am thankful for a new day. Every area of my life flourishes. I flourish in health. I flourish in my business. I flourish in my place of work. I flourish in my ministry. I flourish in my marriage. I flourish in the land. I flourish in my finances. I flourish in my relationship with God and man. I flourish in every season. I will not be detached from the source of living waiters. I will not be envious of the prosperity of the wicked. My strength shall not fail me even in the day of adversity, and I stay connected to the source of life. For the Lord shall bring me into a good land, a land of brooks of water, of fountains and depths. I am brought into a land of wheat, barley, and vines. My land is filled with olive oil and honey. I shall eat bread without scarceness. I shall not lack anything good in all my endeavors. My storage shall be filled with plenty and vats overflow with new wine. The oil in my jar shall never run out. My portion shall not be to sow in the land and reap emptiness. God feeds and satisfies me with the finest of wheat and honey out of the rock. I am confident my provision has been made in full according to His riches in glory in Christ Jesus. In Jesus' name I declare, Amen.